Hey y'all, this is A. Renee from Journal Jot and Job. If this is your first time stopping by the channel, welcome to the channel. If you are a returning subscriber, hey y'all. All right, today is Tuesday, November 21st, 2023. It is a very rainy day. Today I just was dragging a little bit. I needed a reset. I really feel like I haven't realized that I've been on the go since July. Like I haven't really sat down like I had fall break off but I still was moving and today I just feel like my body crashed a little bit so after I took my son to the dentist I came back in and I went back to bed and so now I'm up yeah just learning when to reset has been different for me but anyway we are on part two of setting up my planner and I'm gonna set up a couple of more pages. I've been watching some videos trying to get a couple of ideas. I did see that, who did I watch? I wrote her name down. Oh, what is your name? Claire from online had some cute ideas that I will incorporate. And then there are some things that I did in the other planner that I wanna incorporate, but I'm gonna do it a little differently. So let's go ahead and get into that. So the other day I showed y'all like things that I set up here. I have some sticky notes going on in here. And then I wanna go, y'all yeah, gonna see me keep wiping, but what it is is my desk is scratched up and I haven't taken time to take a brown pen and try to fill it in. But anyway, so I've started kind of sectioning off some sections in the back. This is more so, this is gonna be for my son and anything that deals with information that I need for him. Like if I have to refer back I want to have a quick place to go and I'm also going to take four sheets back here this is going to end up being the washi wall y'all remember I told you I use washi and I tear it off and I like to see what's left either that's going to be the washi wall or this is going to be the washi wall but I'm going to take four sheets which will actually be two front and back one hold on so this is going to be the washi wall so this does not count so this will be four three two one okay i'm gonna take these four pages and this is going to be where i do my photo of the year i need to go back and fill in the rest in this other planner let me give you an example of what i'm talking about and I'm not sure if I took a picture each month because I did get to a point that I stopped taking photos at the end of each month. I know I have one for November. I may have one for October. We don't know. Oh, so in the back of the book, I started putting photos for each month. So we see I stopped at June. I believe I had, I, mm, we gonna see. But the rest of this will be filled in for each month. What I wanted to do a little bit differently in this planner is I'm going to do a page per quarter. So quarter one, we'll have January, February, March, and then a little synopsis of the month. So what I'm gonna do is take a pencil. I got a pencil a while ago in one of the cloth and paper pen subscriptions when I was getting it I have it on pause for right now so I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna trace around it and then I think I'm gonna go ahead and write each month in don't quote me but I'm gonna do that for the first four pages so let's go ahead and do that I'm gonna speed that part up and I'm gonna turn my, my YouTube back on all right so let's go ahead and get into that
I just had to pop in real quick and say, this is the foolery. How do you draw a crooked line when you have a guide? A ruler means nothing to me. A straight edge means nothing to me. But we gonna clean that up. But I just really had to come in and say, this, this is the type of foolishness. And this is taking me way longer than it looks to you. But we gonna get through it. We gonna get through it. So I don't know, I might pause the recording and then come back when it's done, who knows. But let's get back to it. y'all so I finished this section and when I say this took a long time for no reason at all no reason at all but anyway so what I did was I utilized the picture paper that you put into your Canon Ivy or sprocket and I traced it now when I first started I was exact as I started going I made it a little bit larger to go around you know we'll see once I start putting the pictures in but that's what I did so I started out with pencil and then I went around with a Tom bow because y'all know I be wanting to say bow a Tom bow dual brush marker so I just did the black and then I went and did like a drop shadow behind so I still have so many stickers and y'all know I love florals ain't nothing changed we're gonna use some of these stickers up so this will be January, February, March, April, May, June, Hold on. July, August, September, October, November, December. I do want to go in and write quarter one or Q1, Q2. I haven't figured out where I want to put it just yet. So that's why I have not gone in and put that down. At some point, I'll decide how I'm going to write January, February, March. So those are a couple of things that I haven't decided either. So I was like, I'm not going to try to force it. In my mind, I see like J-A-N, F-E-B, M-A-R. So I don't know. We'll figure that out, but we're not going to figure that out today. And again, I just added a couple of the florals just to add some zhuzh to it I don't know and I was thinking I may do the pictures in black and white or sienna as I take them like I'll take them and then I may change the setting on it haven't figured that out just yet what did we say this was gonna be y'all I forgot oh the washi wall so this will be the washi wall page so I'm gonna go in and write that down and put a piece of washi down to prove that it's the washi page so let's go ahead and do that Okay, so that was real simple. I just put the word stick it to me. That's where the washi will go. I think last time I had the word washi wobble, who cares? 
So that is that page. So we got a couple of pages set up. So you got your pen test page to stick it to me. This is gonna be a picture per month. So at the beginning of the month, the end of the month, whatever it is, I'll take a picture, stick it down. It's just a way to kind of look over the year and see how you progressed. And sometimes you can look at the picture and see exactly where you were in that moment. We'll figure out months, how I'll put that down later. I had like an old sticker book. When I tell y'all I've been shopping my stash, but some of them, I don't have all of the months, right? So you see that I have March, then I have June, July, August. So I could possibly use a few of these in some areas and then figure the rest out with the other ones. But like I say, y'all don't know. So we're not gonna try to figure that out. Okay, I think I wanna flip to the front of the book and do a couple of more things. What did I tell y'all that lady said? What's her name? Hey, lady. What is her name? Claire from online did a document your life page and it was really, it was cute. So it's like document your life and then she had things broken down by quarter. So basically kind of like how I did the brain dump of what I would put in my planner, but she had kind of like a reference page. I'm not sure if I want to break it down by yearly, quarterly, monthly, weekly, daily per se, but I did like the document your life. So I think I just want to write that document your life. And then I think that will be the note to myself because y'all know I typically will do a note to myself inside of a planner and or a journal. So I think that's what I wanna do is call it document your life. And then I'm gonna write a note to myself. Yep, that's, that's, that's what I think I wanna do. All right, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna set this up. Remember two of these this is supposed to be the vision board and goals. We're gonna work that out, just not on here, on this here day. But we are gonna write the document, your life. So let's do that, all right? I'm gonna go ahead and speed that up, and I think that might be it for today's video, and then we'll do part three. We just, I'm just gonna carry y'all on in until I get this thing set up, all right? Alright y'all, so that's my document your life unapologetically page and I kept it really simple because I'm going to write a note to myself, but please be clear as I was writing this, I was like, girl, please don't mess up, please don't spell something wrong. I know I can put a, pa a piece of paper on top of it, but that ain't the point, but that's what I did. So a lot of what I used today y'all was things that I already had around the house, nothing is new. Nothing is new. The stickers outside of the planner, nothing that I used today was new at all. Well, I take that back. This was my first time using this pencil, but I had that for a while. All right, so give it a try. Let me know in the comment section if you learned something new for the day, and I will catch y'all on the next one.